smashing. Hey guys, so this time around I wanted to show you how to resize a partition. Um, this is a free uh, bit of software. Um, I want to say that's Ease US or Ease Us, but uh, the, the brand's really popular. It's, it's very common. It's been around for a long time. Um, this is the little launch screen once you open the program. It gives you the option to download these three free tools as well. They have a free data recovery, a uh, free backup and recovery, and a free uh, PC transfer software, um, which, you know, kudos. But what we're going to be doing is resizing a partition. So we're going to launch this. I recently upgraded to Windows 10, and I did it on a separate partition on my hard drive, and so I've been having to move stuff over from my old partition because every external hard drive I have is completely packed full so I'm at, this is I'm having to do this the very very slow way okay so what we're going to do here is this is my old partition so what we're going to do is we need to shrink this one so that we can enlarge this one because C drive is always your main drive it's always the partition that you're booting to. Okay, so we're going to click on this one. We're going to click on this one right here. And you need to right click on it and go to resize. Or you can just click on it and go right over here to resize. Either way is perfectly fine. So we're going to resize. Now your immediate instinct is going to go to right here. You're going to try to type in stuff or use the buttons and all this and that. You don't need to do that. Literally, all you have to do is come right up here and drag it down. And that's going to shrink it. Okay? So that's step one of this. You see, if you look right here, it shows an allocated space. After we shrink that, it shows that we're shrinking that much extra space so about 12 gigs worth you're going to hit OK now what we're doing that's the shrinking part now what we're going to do is we want to add that to our C partition so we're going to click on our C partition and again you can either right click on it and go to resize or you can go right up here to resize this time around I'll, I'll right click on it and resize okay so now what we want to do is we want to take it right here we want to stretch this out and we're adding all of that unallocated space that we had to this partition I'm going to hit OK alright so now what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to hit apply. So you see in the pending operations, resize and resize, right? So now what we have to do is we have to hit apply. Alright, so I'm going to hit apply and I'm going to try to get uh, recorded uh, doing its process with my phone, which so forgive me if it's not the best quality. So we're going to hit apply. Two operations are currently pending. Do you want to apply? Yes, we do. Operation Metacry rebooting. Hit yes. Okay, so we've got the computer restarting at the moment. Okay, it's loading back into Windows. And as you can see, it brings up the partition editor right here. And as you can see, it's starting to move it. And it shows that it's operation one of two, which was shrinking that first partition. And then the second operation will be extending the C drive, adding that free space to that partition 
and once it's complete it'll boot right back up into Windows and you're good to go and I will show you what that looks I will show you after it loads back into Windows I'll show you our resized partitions okay guys so you can see now boot it back up into Windows um, that 12 gigs that we took from the E drive has now been transferred over to the C drive now we have 35 gigs free and there's only about 9 gigs free on this one um, like I said it's like that because I installed I had Windows 7 installed as my main system and I, uh, I shrunk that had some unallocated space I installed Windows 10 to it um, decide to stay with Windows 10 so I'm slowly migrating all my stuff over to my new partition so that I can get rid of this one altogether um, I hope this helps y'all um, really wish my external hard drives weren't so full of stuff so that I could do this a lot quicker but they give me the opportunity to make this video for y'all if you enjoyed it please give me a big thumbs up it really helps um, and thanks a lot. Hello, Smithers. You're quite good at turning me on. Um, you probably should ignore that.